Now, in this question, digital sum of a number is obtained by adding all the digits of a number until a single digit is obtained. Find the digital sum of 19 raised to 100. Friends, uh, before we proceed with this problem, I would just like to share a concept with you. Suppose I have a number that is uh, maybe 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 1, 2, 3. Okay. Suppose I wish to find out the digital sum of this particular number. So let's begin. 4 plus 5, 9. 9 plus 6, 15. 15 plus 7, 22. 22 plus 8, 30. 39, 40, 41, 42. And then plus 3, 45. That's actually 9. Okay. Similarly, I have other number. Maybe 2, 3, 7, 1, 5, 4, Two. Okay, so uh, let me find the digital root of this number. It's 2 plus 3, 5, and plus 7, 12, 13, 13 plus 5, 18, 18 plus 4, 22, 22 plus 2, 24. That means 2 plus 4. Finally, we are getting 6. Uh, let's compare both the cases. This number is actually multiple of 9, and this number is not a multiple of 9. Okay, if the number is multiple of 9, the digital sum will always be uh, 9 only. Okay, friends. And in this case, the digital sum is always a remainder which I am getting after dividing this number by 9. Let's divide this number by 9. What I will be getting is, uh, you, you, I hope you are clear with the divisibility test of 9. Let's cancel the uh, number which are making the sum as 9. See this 7 and 2. It is making 9. So let's cancel them. Then 5 plus 4. Uh, we are left with 3 plus 2, 5 and 1, 6. Which is the digital sum of this number. Okay. So I just would make a recap over here. That digital sum of any number is the remainder which we are getting if we divide that number by 9. It is as simple as that. If you are getting the remainder as 0, then the digital sum will be 9 only as in this case. You can take up any other examples. Suppose I have 7, 2, 3, 5, 4. Here 9, 9 and uh, we are left with 3. So digital sum of this number will be 3. Or alternatively, we just add up all the digits. That is 7, 2, 3, 5, 4. Here I got 3. Let's see what, what happens over here. It is 7 plus 2, 9 plus 3, 12, 12 plus 5, 17, 17 plus 4, 21. That is 2 plus 1. We are getting 3. Okay, friends. So you can make this comparison and uh, you have to be very, uh, you are, you'll be very clear about the uh, digital sum concept. Okay. Now let's do this problem. Just a moment. That means even in this case, the dig digital sum of 19 raised to 100 will be a number or a remainder which we are getting if we divide 19 raised to 100 by 9. So let's divide 19 raised to 100 by 9. Okay, 19 can be written as 18 plus 1 then raised to 100. And if we divide this expression by 9, each and every term will be multiple of 9 except 1 raised to 100. Since all the terms will definitely contain 18 except the last term that is 1 raised to 100. Now 1 raised to 100 is what? 1. Okay. So the remainder which we are getting if we divide 19 raised to 100 by 9 is 1 and so is the digital sum of this particular number. I hope you are clear with the method. You can try some of the problems on your own also. 